What's going on guys, Michael Tiger Supplies, and today we're going over Nikon Total Stations, in particular the N versus the K series. Um, both of these are that middle ground total station you'll typically hook up with a data collector, and we get this question all the time as to what's the difference. So jumping right into it, know that there's two main differences. The N series is reflectorless, while the K series is not. It's prism only, all right? So with both of these models, um, with the prism, you'll be able to shoot about 13,000 feet. And then with that N series in the reflectorless mode, you'll be able to shoot about 1,900 feet. Now, the next major difference is that the N series features a, a laser pointer, while the K series does not. Now, it's a handy feature for some of the guys out there in the field, um, but just note, you know, it's not necessary for all types of work. Now, let's jump into some of the similarities. The first being is that both of these models are offered in a two second and a five second gun. All right, they both have 50,000 uh, internal points of storage built right into that hard drive. Um, they're both Bluetooth compatible. They both offer the dual screen models if needed. And even more so, something we really do like is their charging capabilities. Um, Nikon in this latest series offered it so that you can actually plug in via a USB power bank. So, you know, no more battery swapping. If you're out there in remote areas, you can actually just use a power bank to charge and you'll be good to go. So, you know, to wrap everything up, these Nikon series are an excellent total station for, for that middle of the ground using a data collector. And you now know the difference between the Nikon N and Nikon K series.